ಶ್ರೀಮಾನ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರಕ ವಿದ್ಯಾರ್ಕೇಕ ಕೇಸರಿ ವೇದಾಂತಾಚಾರ್ಯವರಿಯೋ ಮೇ ಸನ್ನಿಧತ್ತಾಂ ಸದಾ ಹೃದಯ ರಾಮಾಣಜ ದಯಾಪಾತ್ರ ಜ್ಞಾನ ವೈರಾಗ್ಯಭೂಷಣ ಶ್ರೀಮತ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ವಂದೇ ವೇದಾಂತ ದೇಶಿಕ ನೀಳಾತುಂಗಸ್ತನಗಿರಿತಿ ಶುದ್ಧಮುದ್ಬೋಧ್ಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪಾರಾರ್ಥ್ಯ ಸ್ವಂ ಶ್ರತಿ ಶತಶಿರಸಿಧ್ಯಾಪಯಂತ ಶೋಚಿಷ್ಟಾಂ ಶಜನಿ ಗಿಳಿದ ಯಾಬಲಾಕೃತ್ಯ ಪುಂಕ್ತೆ ಗೋದಾತಸ್ಯೈ ನಮಯಿತಮಿದ ಭೂಯೇವಾಸ್ತು ಭೂಯ ಅನ್ನವಯಲ್ ಪುದುವೈ ಆಂಡಾಳರಂಗರ್ಕ ಪನ್ನತಿರುಪ್ಪಾವೈ ಪಲ್ಪತಿಯ ಇನ್ನಿಶಯಾಲ್ ಪಾಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಣ್ಣರ್ಪಾಮಾಲೈ ಪೂಮಾಲೈ ಶೂಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತಾಳೈ ಚೊಲ್ಲೆ ಶೂಡಿ ಕೊಡುತ್ತ ಶುಡರ್ ಹೊಡಿಯೇ ತೊಲ್ಪಾವೈ ಪಾಡಿಯರುಳವಲ್ಲ ಪಲ್ವಳೆಯಾಯ್ ನಾಡಿನಿ ವೆಂಕಟವರ್ ಕೆನ್ನೈದಿ ಎನ್ರ ಇಮ್ಮಾಟ್ರ ನಾಮ್ ಕಡವ ವಣ್ಣಮೇ ನಲ್ಹೆ ಟುಡೇಸ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಈಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ತರ್ಡ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಪೆರ್ಕರಣೈ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಇನ್ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ಇನ್ನರ್ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಎಂಜಾಯ್ ದ ಪಾಸುರಂ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಗೋ ಓವರ್ ದ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಭಾರಿ ಮಲೆಮುಳಂಜಿಲ್ ಬಂಡಿ ಕೆಡಂದುರಾಂಗುಂ ಶೀರ್ಯ ಶಿಂಗಂ ಅರಿವುಟ್ರಿತ್ತಿ ವಿಳಿತ್ತೆ ಫೇರಿಮಯರ್ ಪೊಂಗ ಎಪ್ಪಾಡೂ ಪೇರ್ದುದರಿ ಮೂರಿನ ಮರಂದು ಮುಳಂಗಿ ಪುರಪ್ಪಟ್ಟೆ ಪೋದರುಮಾ ಪೋಲೇ ನೀ ಪೂವೈ ಪೂವಣ್ಣ ಒನ್ ಕೋಯಿಲ್ ನಿಂಗಳೇ ಪೋಂದರುಳಿ ಕೋಪ್ಪುಡೆಯ ಸೀರಿಯ ಸಿಂಗಾ ಹಸನತ್ತಿರಂದೆ ಯಾಮ್ ಮಂದಗಾರಿಯ ಮಾರಾಯಿಂದೆ ಅರುಳೇಲೋ ರೆಂಬಾವಾಯ್ ಇಂದೆ ಸ್ಪಾಸುರಾಮ್ ಆಂಡಾಳ್ ಸೀಕ್ಸ್ ಟು ಸೆಲಿಬ್ರೇಟ್ to enjoy kannan's from kannan's beautiful form of reclining posture she wants to enjoy the beauty beauty of his waking up and the beauty of his walk and the beauty of his him sitting in a simhasana majestically divinely so in ramayana tara and mandodari were blessed with the vision of standing posture of sri rama valmiki showed the beauty of sri rama's reclining posture in darbashayanam sita enjoyed the reclining posture the reclining beauty of rama in chitrakuta so intensely that she even failed to notice kakasura tormenting wounding her the rishis the the recluses the sanyasis the forest enjoyed rama sitting posture majestically sitting divine posture so here gopi and andal would like to enjoy his getting up his waking up his walking and sitting in the majestic throne simhasana so the alvars always enjoy and they are delighted to enjoy kannan's beauty whether it is in the cradle or in his waking up or in his childhood pranks leelas whatever it is so and we also enjoy ranganathan's beautiful gait on a horse his bewitching majestic march on the on the elephant on the sheshavahana and on the yali so this is enough to send the the goosebumps through our body gopi says similar to that they would like to enjoy the beauty of sleep as well as his waking up as well as his walk and present himself on the throne in the grand hall so that everybody can see so kannan immediately assures himself into the grand hall he walks he gets up first he gets up comes out gets rid of the lethargy and then walks so beautifully and be seated in the simhasana that's definitely a feast for the eye andal gives a beautiful description of this of this wonderful vision she says he walks in like a lion 
which which was sleeping in the depth of the mountain cave when there was heavy rain outside it was it was warm inside the cave it rouses itself it rises and then thinks of moving out of the cave it sends out a frightening reverberating roar stretching its legs and body it warms up its body shaking its mane the back of the neck and standing high and looks at its surroundings left and right it majestically walks ahead and places itself head high on top of the short cliff like the lion king kanan strides majestically similar to that lord of the jungle he is yadava simha he is indeed the cub yashoda ilan chingam cub of yashoda the alvas have, have celebrated kannan as a lion devaki singame talelo shitrayar singame ayar kula shiriya singamam devaki singattai paadi para peyalvar enjoy kula shekar alvar enjoy so kannan emphasizes with the gopis and she says i have come sat down now what do you want he he feels for the gopis they had come walking in the wee hours of the morning under a showering or under a mist fog waking up the other friends of ayer party waking up the gods on duty waking up his parents so he requests them to ask tell me what you need and assures that he will bestow he will grant gopi say you are dark hued with the color of khayam pu pu vai pu vanna you are you are dark blue hued flower like divine trimeni un koyil nindringane pondarali koppudaya seeriya singhasana thirinde yan vanda karyam aaraindu arul you have woken up from your slumber you have seated yourself on the throne we shall tell you all about us the you just remember your statement at the sea shore your statement at the chariot i shall grant refuge for one and all for all those who perform sharanagati so sarva bhudebhyo dadam etat vratam mama you said as a rama kannan then so your words will become trustworthy your words have become decree the the court order kannan adorned the simhasanam with a majestic gate having drunk the beauty of kannan having seen and enjoyed his majestic seating the gopis began to praise him with songs pamalai oh lord we need your benediction your your merciful glances it is possible for one to win over anything with lords granting lords benedictions lords blessings on our side asking for anything else would would be a momentary transitory pleasure so you should bless us that's all the hidden meaning is the jeevan should pray only for lords benedictions lords anugraham without any self motive if we do that the lord would come out of ahobilam and and bestow upon the soul the fruits of all his actions so the without attaching ourselves to the fruit we perform with a satvik atyagam that he himself does and through me for his pleasure so in which case we would never get attached to the fruits whether it's positive or negative so this pasuram is on yashoda ilan chingam the gopis described the majestic gate of krishna simham yadava simham in the previous pasuram they announced their arrival at the at the foot of his cart and appealed to him to wake up and look at them and inquire about their mission he obliges he wakes up now they say please walk like a lion and be seated in the chimasanam t 
think why we have come here for and bless us with your benedictions this pasuram is considered to be dedicated to sri lakshmi narasimhan also perikarana swami sri chakravartya swami the asthana vidwana of sri ahobila matam he gave this explanation that in the hills of ahobila in the cave malolan sri lakshmi narasimhan was in deep sleep <coughs> mannikidandu urangina he is a serious himasana he is a shingam he reflected on the unfortunate children of his of the kali yuga and their deep ignorance ajnanam took pity on them had the sankalpam to bless them so he came out of the caves of ahobila sat in the palms of sri adivan chatakopar ji went on to sancharam to the villages and towns all over india in the company of the mat ji and his successors to grow the tatva gnanam of people to bless them with sharanagati at his trivadi so the number is 23rd pasuram the 23rd 23 itself is a good number when you add 2 plus 3 it is 5 swami says the fifth nakshatram is mrigasirisha the one who has the head of an animal narasimhan hayagrivan varahar they all have the heads of animal mrigona bhima kucharo girishtah the mrigasirishan referred here is to narasimhan the pasuram is about the narasimha murti showing us the marga sirisham talai siranda upayam margam the way sirisham the 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 chief of the paths is sharanagati margam for our salvation and the acharya ramanujas aradhya devam was lakshmi narasimhan he appointed the 74 simhasana adhipatis and gave each of them the deity of sri lakshmi narasimhan asked them to spread the glory of our sampradayam and enhance its splendor through the aradhanam of lakshmi narasimhan trivaranga tamudanar says this as the important niyamanam of acharya Ram- ramanuja this way valarda venkopa madangolanrai kirittavan keerthi pai elindu vilaindidum chintai ramanushan so here andal in her 25th third pasuram sang about the vaibhavam of narasimhan mannikidandu urangum shiriya shingam such a beautiful manner the 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 gate the simhasanam of shiriya shingam is talked about by our andal and that describes how the lord should majestically come out of his chamber just as the majestic lion crouching in sleep inside the mountain cave during the rainy season with its mate and becoming awake opens his fire emitting ferocious fiery eyes looks all around as the king of animals and and with a roar vigorously moves and shakes the locks of hair on its fragrant mane standing erect gets up majestically gives a loud roar simmanatham the may you the lord of enchanting bluish hue of khayampu flower karunaidal pu the blue hued trimeni emerge from your show holy shrine the asthanam come out this way and blessing us by the darshana saubhagyam of your walk of your gate simmagathi blessing us by the darshana saubhagyam and be seated on the perfectly suited well deserving simhasanam and look into our purpose of our coming here and waking you up swami perkarana swami mentions mari mulai mulanjil mannikidandurangum shiriya singam arivutritti vilitti receiving the blessing of divya gnanam from lakshmi narasimhan who is the enduring principle of ragasya triams of the upanishad vakyams which pour knowledge about punya papams and awakening us and he himself wakes up as a result of his divya anugraham of his of his grace on us he wakes up veri mayirpanga eppadum perndu udari moori nimirndu mulangi purappattu 
எப்பாடும் பூவை பூ அண்ணா மே யூ வாக் ஜேர்னி டு ஸ்ரீ வைகுண்டம் டு த சவுண்ட் ஆஃப் மங்கள வாத்தியம் டு யுவர் சிம்மாசனம் மே யூ அபவுட் த யூ பர்ஃபார்ம் யுவர் நித்திய கர்மாஸ் ஆஃப் சேவிங் அஸ் ஸ்ப்ரெட் த க்ளோரிஸ் ஆஃப் த லார்ட் ஆஃப் ஃப்ராக்ரண்ட் கேசம்ஸ் and supreme buddhi vikasam the manifestation of your your wonderful jnana chudar puvai puvanna o atma jnani with blossomed jnanam nin koil nindrum leaving from the hridaya pundarika the the cave of the heart where the lord resides and proceeding in the path shown by adivahikas you are taking the jivatma to your abode கோப்புடைய சீரிய சிங்காசனத்தை திருந்து ஸ்டேயிங் அட் த பரியங்கம் ஆஃப் த லார்ட் அட் இஸ் கமாண்ட் யாம் வந்த காரியம் ஆராய்ந்த அருள் ஸோ பிளீஸ் பிளஸ் அஸ் வித் சர்வவித கைங்கரியம் ஹியர் இட் ஆல்சோ மீன்ஸ் த த ஆச்சாரியா இட் கேன் அட்ரஸ் த ஆச்சாரியா தட் யூ பிளீஸ் ரெக்கமெண்ட் அவர் கேஸ் வித் த லார்ட் for us to be blessed with sarva vidha kaikaryam adiye kavitarkika simhaya kalyana guna shaline shrimate venkatesaya vedanta gurave namaha dhanyasme